In proving a personal injury case in the state of New York, sometimes a lawyer has to turn to experts. One type of expert that lawyers use are economists. Now, why do you use an economist? Well, in a regular lawsuit, you're asking for money for pain and suffering. You're trying to win an award of monetary compensation for the client, and they've suffered an injury. For example, they've suffered a broken leg. And you're asking for pain and suffering from the date of the incident up until the date of trial, known as past pain and suffering. And you're also asking for future pain and suffering from the date of trial up until the end of their life. If it's a serious injury, it's debilitating, and it's going to affect them for the rest of their life. And in the same way, you have economic damages. Economics, or monetary damages, or hard numbers, as they're known in the industry. Well, here you turn to an expert, such as an economist, and they tell you that this person has been working uh, five days a week, you know, five years, or at one job, and before that, seven years at another job, and they look at their earning history, they look at their employment, and they say that they work at a specific job. For example, they work as, let's say, uh, as, a, as a plumber. So they, they, they work as a plumber, and they make a certain salary. They make, let's say, $50,000 a year. So because of the accident, they could not go back to doing their job. Sometimes the injury is so severe that they cannot go back to that profession and they have to choose another profession or vocation because they simply can't do the physical labor involved with their original job. And so the economist will then talk about past lost earnings, lost wages, from the date of the accident up until the date of trial, which could be a year or two or maybe even longer if it's a complex case. And also they'll talk about future lost earnings from the date of the trial up until the rest of their life using life expectancy tables and other data that is used in the pattern jury instructions when a judge instructs a jury at trial. And so the economist is sometimes very invaluable, very helpful to a plaintiff because without them, you would be limited only to the pain and suffering damages where with an economist and with the proper disclosures under CPLR 3101D, expert exchanges and proper um, documentation, well now you can prove that a person, especially a younger person who's in their 20s who is severely injured, if they can't go back to work for a number of years, with inflation and with uh, all of the economic data, you could have uh, both past and future lost earnings numbers in the millions, which would add to the total value of the case, both for settlement purposes as well as a verdict at the time of trial.